Bendy. Bendy. What? What? All right, dude. We're here. Oh. Really? Yeah. We should hurry, though. The lights are still on, but if we don't, then, you know, there might be closing. I don't know. I'm surprised they're still open so late. Maybe they have people that work night shift. I don't know. I'm lucky we made it. You realize how hard it is to drive with inky hands? I'm surprised my hands didn't slip off the wheel while merging. Well, at least I got one that's kind of not so much. I don't understand what any of those words mean. <sighs> Let's just go in. All right. <sighs> Ladies first. <sighs> of course. Wait, that just kind of clicked in my head. What? We just, like, walked in here. We didn't even knock or nobody let us in. We just kind of walked in. Hey, you're right. We did just kind of waltz in here. Huh. Well, this place has to be open then. That or they just have really bad security. Yeah. Though, Gent Corporation doesn't sound like a place that have bad security. Do we even know what they actually do here? God, if I know. <sighs> Bendy? Bendy? Uh-oh. Hey, buddy, this isn't funny. If you're playing a little joke on me. <laughs> I don't like how you just disappeared while going, whoa. Um, Bendy? Should I be scared right now? I'm a little tense. Huh? What's going on with my hand? Huh? Whoa, 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 lady, lady, put, put down the weapon. Uh, it, it, it's just, oh, sorry, it's just, um, <clears throat> it's just a pepper spray. <laughs> pepper spray that glows? Uh, uh, sorry, it's on my key ring. My flashlight must have turned on. Hi, Audrey. Bendy, what the hell was that? And who's this guy? I am security around here, and uh, I've got a couple questions for the two of you. Oh, whew. Uh, sorry, I was really worried there. Yeah. So, what the hell are you two doing in our building? Oh, <laughs> right. Uh, you see, uh, Bendy, could I explain, please? Oh, sure. I guess you probably know more about this than I do. We waltz in here because we're looking for somebody. Hmm. Normally, I don't just let people that walk into the building stay around, but, uh... I guess we'll I'll help you find whoever the heck you're looking for. And then you two better be out of here. Especially you. Pretty good cosplay, by the way. C cosplay? It's- I- I- You know, I never mind. Uh, yeah, that's just my little brother, Benny. He just loves this show so much, so he just likes dressing up as the character. Hmm. All right. All right, get off, Squirt. Ow! <sighs> I kind of like that, actually. All right, follow me. Whew, all right, I think we got this, bud. Okay. Listen, I'm just saying, finding things got so rough with the new experiments, and what the hell? Hey guys, so uh, two people waltzed in here and said they were looking for somebody. I don't know if it's any visiting family or something. Uh, why don't you come on in? Hello. Whoa, rad cosplay, dude. Wait, are these guys looking for a tour? Dude, co tours close at 6. It's like 11 p.m. We don't give tours this late. No, 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 it's not that, I promise. All right, well, make it snappy. What's up? Oh, we were kind of directed here by somebody. Uh, we were looking for someone named Wilson. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> did I hear that right? You're looking for Wilson? Yes. Is he here or no? You're looking for the, the janitor? What? Yeah, Wilson's our janitor. Were you expecting somebody else? Well, not particularly. I guess not. Audrey, if I had a hunch, I think that Sammy guy might be sending us on a wild goose chase! I, I, I mean, I can go get him. I think he's in the back. Uh, just give me a moment. Let's just see what's up with him. Come on, this is our only lead now, Bendy. Bendy? Sorry, Benny. I meant Benny. <sighs> All right, I guess. <sighs> uh... 
Hey, I meant to ask. Is that puddle of black goo? Is your janitor gonna get on that? Oh, no, that that's supposed to be there. Yeah, it's uh, our ink supply. It's how we make the cartoons. Make the cartoons? Wait, but Sammy said Bendy died out like 40 years ago. Oh, well, it did. It's just, uh, we revived it. After we acquired all the assets from Joey. Well, well Nathan Arch did. And we just kind of helped him produce all these cartoons. Archgate Pictures. It's a subsidiary of the Gent Corporation. It's pretty neat. Uh, oh. Huh. Wait, but if you guys make the cartoons, who stars in them? All right, here he is. B Bendy. Huh? Was somebody looking for me? Oh, hi. Uh, I'm Audrey, and someone told us to come looking for you? <laughs> well, I guess I do have visitors every once in a while. All right. Hey, so we were referred to you by a guy named Sammy? Ah, Sammy Lawrence. Yes, yes, I remember him quite well. Oh, uh, what about him? Well, I sold him off a copy, one of our last two copies of The Illusion of Living by Joey Drew. Though I didn't tell him it was the last two, it's just the last copy. To him, anyway. Oh. Hmm. Wait, Wilson, you've been selling off all our stock, dude? Uh, small stuff here and there. I clean up around here, and usually Nathan, when closing, he, you know, lets me keep some of the stuff. I was a big fan of Bendy growing up. He used to show me all the cartoons all the time. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna get back to what I was doing. Anyway, yeah. Mm. Well, now that everyone's attention is off of us, what did you need from me, dear? Well, well, if you can't tell, I'm kind of not really normal around here. And I'm getting the sense that you aren't either. <sighs> It all started a few months ago. It had been rounding our first year of acquiring Bendy and all his licensing, and Nathan wanting to open the animation studio. I stumbled upon something that nobody else had any knowledge of. They called it the Ink Machine. The Ink Machine? Yes, it's producing that substance over there. I figured out it had life-bending properties able to bring cartoons to life. And well, experimenting with it had gotten a little on me, but... Gosh, the possibilities. It fixed my broken eye, as you can see. Oh. Wow, that's impressive. Indeed. I believe it had done similar things to all the people that worked at the old studio. That's why I tried to employ my other employees to not touch the goo, and that's why I handled it all myself. Oh. Interesting. <clears throat> I can tough it out, though. It's not too bad, really. Yeah. So, what does that mean for me? Well, did you used to work for Joey? You seem quite young. I'd be kind of surprised. No, seriously, I used to be just a normal girl, and then I woke up, and I was all like this. I don't even know why. How peculiar. I'm deeply sorry about that. It's nothing, really. Hmm. Hmm. Well, did you find out all you needed to know? Not really. I do have one question, though. Is there any way to wash it off? <laughs> Girl, I have tried every single shampoo under the sun. It doesn't come off. <sighs> hmm. Well, if that's all you need, I should be getting back to my duties. A lot of the places are rather messy. Hey, dude, don't get too close to that ink. Why? Huh? Oh! Huh? Hello there! What the? Huh? <sighs> Great. Hi, Bendy. Hi there, Mr. Fox. 
Not my name, dude. Huh, you're a real silly guy, you know that? B Bendy? Whoa, a nice costume! Uh, thanks. So who are you? <laughs> wow, you're real funny, you know that? Trying to say you don't know who I am when you're dressing up as me? <laughs> I'm Bendy! I'm the star of the cartoons around here! Alright, dude, this wasn't meant for a visitation. You can go back in the ink now. Yeah, little man, it's your bedtime now. <sighs> but he woke me up! I... I don't get it. But I thought... I was Bendy. This is some kind of a joke, but, uh, yeah. I'm Bendy. I hang out with Boris and Alice. Uh, I don't really particularly know what you do around here. I don't understand. Bendy, I don't think we should be around here. This probably isn't good for your amnesia. Why has he replaced me? But, Bendy, you don't even understand this life. You don't even know what you had before. Maybe this is something you agreed to? No, I, I, I never agree to this. I just... I just know. If I was really made by this Joey Drew guy... Then why did I end up lost and discarded? I don't know. You're saying a lot of words I don't understand, pal. <laughs> No. I'm not standing for this. Wait, what? I'm... I'm taking you to court! What? What does that mean? Wait, what? Uh, is that, like, serious? What? Yeah, if Joey made me, and this really is all my stuff, then what gives you all the right to have it? Uh, well, I, I, I don't know. We just kind of acquired the assets, didn't we? Yeah, what did Joey leave it as well? Yeah, I'm Bendy. I ain't afraid to admit it. This isn't some stupid costume. I can't tear this off. Um... I'm suing you for taking what's mine, defamation of character, and being a big, stupid pushover. Ow! This is my stuff, my company. Okay, Bendy, I think you're getting a little in over your head. Uh, you don't want to turn them against us now. Is this a joke? Are you actually taking us to court? I I'm gonna figure out a way. This dude really believes he's Bendy. All right, that's it. Uh, whoa! Bendy, wait, hey, wait, we can talk this out. You're coming with me too, Missy. Whoa! Let go of me! Uh, you'll, you'll all hear from me. You'll feel my wrath. I plead the fifth! So you're seriously considering taking us to court? Yes! All right, then. Good luck with that. Uh, uh, uh. <sighs> <sighs> Yeah, we showed them, right, Aud? Tree? What the hell was that? Uh, I, well, I was taking them to court. You know, we're gonna, we're gonna fight a legal battle and get all my stuff back. Do you realize now where we are? I have nothing. We have nothing. We can win, right? I mean, what good? Dad wouldn't leave stuff to his kids. Bendy! You are a cartoon character. Just because you were brought to life doesn't just make you Joey Drew's kid. Well, you don't know that. Besides, you have amnesia, and we just saw a second Bendy. Who even knows if you're the first one? But can't we at least try? Why? So we can end up in debt? This case is gonna go try for sure. I know it. Again, you don't know that. You don't even give a crap about what Bendy was until about two days ago. You don't know its history. And heck, maybe I don't either, but we can figure it out. Okay, but this is straying the path of what I'm setting out to do. Sure, maybe you wanna go fight legal battles about your stupid company or whatever, but I don't. I just wanna be normal again. Yeah, but what other choice do you really have, Audrey? Wilson came up dry, and you don't really have any other leads as to what that ink stuff is. 
So, maybe this can benefit the both of us. Let's say I win the case, and I get all of Joey's assets. Then, you know, we can figure out what the ink stuff is. Do more research on it. Figure out how to get rid of it, so then you can go back to your old life. You know? <sighs> yeah. I guess you have a point. Come on. Unless you want to be some stupid ink creature for the rest of your life. What other choice do you really have? <sighs> I guess you're right. Yeah. There you go. Why is your hand glowing again? I don't know. Oh, God! I'm sorry! I didn't mean to do that! Oh, God! Uh, uh. <coughs> oh, God. Ow! That hurt! I I'm sorry! I I'm sorry! I just... I think when I'm under a lot of stress and pressure, it just activates. I, I don't know. Oh, God, my hand. <sighs> okay. I just lost my train of thought. What are we doing now? Taking the, the Gent Corporation to court. Y yes, right, that, but... Oh, it's like midnight. We need a place to stay. All right, well, we drove like six hours here, and I'm tired, too. Let's just find a hotel in the area or something. I'm sure there's a place we can stay. All right, let's go to the car. <sighs> Whoa! And you're too lucky I decided to clock in some overtime tonight. Hi, can we have a room? Two twin size, please? Mm, okay, let me check my logs. Oh, uh, it seems like we only got one room with a king size, so, uh, gonna have to pay for that one. <sighs> Alright, fine. Hmm. Hey, wait a minute. You Bendy? Oh, yeah. Huh. My dad used to love your old cartoons. He showed me some of them all the time. Oh my god. I can't believe that they started making new ones. <laughs> when I have my own kid, I know what he's watching. <laughs> uh, yeah. What are you doing with this random lady? Ain't you a celebrity or something? Shouldn't you be going making old cartoons, sleeping in your king-size room, you know, your master suite? <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. C can you please not? He's just kind of uncomfortable about the topic right now. Whoa, whoa, okay, okay. I'm sorry, just trying to lighten the mood. <laughs> I, heck, I kind of thought you two were on a date or something. Ew, no! God, no! What the hell is wrong with you? you? Huh, we finally agreed on something for once. Yeah. Okay, okay, God, I'm getting your damn key. <sighs> All right. Room 216 on the second floor. Thank you. Have a good evening, you two. Let me get back to napping. Talk about sleeping with one eye open. <sighs> Alright, Bendy. Let's go. Decent little place. Yeah. Opposite ends of the bed? Yes. Damn, and of course they only give us one frickin' pillow. <sighs> I'm getting real sleepy. Me too. <sighs> Night, Bendy. Damn, and he slept on the car ride, too. A little shit. Ew, I'm in this stupid goo stuff. Ugh, 
gross. Great. Just how I wanted to spend my dream. Bendy. Huh? The hell? Bendy. Oh, great. Look at that. It's another me. Hey, bigger, taller, face cover. What are you trying to say? I got imposter syndrome or something, buddy? You are denying the truth, Bendy. Yeah, I, I know, sure. Look, he just made me real pissed, all right? No one likes the feeling of being replaced. Also, I didn't come to have a dream where I talk to my inner self and I unlearn more things about myself. Listen, just, just, just shut up, man. Let me sleep in peace. Just get the hell out of here. Hey, one day you'll understand the truth. <laughs> yeah, serves him right for trying to interrupt my dream. <gasps> Who are I am the ink demon? Uh, okay. Yeah. With the other guy? A mere reflection of you. No, 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 no. I am my own beast entirely. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> 